I've been thinking a lot. I tend to do this every couple of... Well, let's just say I do this every so often. I tend to think a little too much about what will happen. And I... And this is probably the first time that I've actually noticed myself stressing out about it. <laughs> I mean, normally people around me are stressing out because they don't know what the hell's going on. But because I'm on my own, and I have, well, maybe only one person to tell, but don't end up telling that person. I hold it all in, and I never let any of it out. Sometimes, I tend to not think about, or well, I try not to think about things that bother me, but I can't help that. It eventually gets to the point where the thought of something that I don't want to be bothered by bothers me. I don't know what I'm saying. <sighs> which is most, which is most of the time anyway. Um, I don't know much. <laughs> I will be the first to admit that. I don't know a hell of a lot, but I do know that I am sick to death of having to hear the same old thing. I don't want to hear the same old thing. It seems to me that within the people that I know back there, maybe one or two people are attempting or have succeeded in making a change. Not only for themselves, but the people around them, the people that matter most. Me? I'm about ready to put some boots to asses, mainly my own, and I know it ain't going to happen overnight, but I'm fixing to make a change for me, okay? Okay, I don't want to be stuck in the same position that I was in when I left. I want a full 180 when it comes to my life. I'm almost a quarter century year. I'm almost that in the age, damn it. <laughs> okay, I don't want to think about that until it comes about, which is still just a tad over a month away. Okay? I don't need to worry about my 25th birthday until the 12th of January next year. Okay, the only thing that I want to worry about, okay, I don't need to worry about making the trip back to friggin' Toowoomba. I've got that figured out, all right? I do not need to worry about anything AWF related over the next two weeks because I know Greg and the team and the guys and girls that work the matches and the wrestlers, the trainees, the, the camera crew, Kieran, everybody, they've got that sorted out. I don't need to worry about that, and I don't even know why I brought that up, but still, I don't need to worry about that. In fact, I'm looking forward to the next two, the last two events the AWF are holding this year. You know, I, I, I don't, um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Okay. 
It's just that I get the feeling that no matter what it is that I do, the people that I care most about, they're not making the changes that they need to make in order to make their lives better. Okay, I've been gone for almost three months. Very close to three months now. And I'm not... And I've come to the realization that if I go back to Tara, the same thing, the same way that I was before I left, then I'm going to be miserable. Okay? I am fixing to make a change for myself. If I end up doing it here, and people will notice, I know that. I have never been more determined to make a change in my life than I am at this very moment. And I don't care if it takes me ten minutes to tell you that, okay? This is my bloody video. I get to do whatever the friggin' hell I please. And if you don't like it, well, that's your problem, not mine. I don't want to lose viewers or subscribers or friends for that matter on YouTube. But if you don't like the way in which I present myself from here on out, then it's time, maybe, then maybe, maybe you just caught me at the right, wrong time. I don't know. Very many things are going on in my mind, and I'm fixing to make everything right. Now, I don't care how long it takes, as long as I got it here and here, I will never stop until I make that change. That's all I gotta say about that. So until next time.